Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nog. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to play SR Latch by T Chapman 500. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. But without further ado, let's jump into the description. The test chamber is split into two sections separated by something similar to an SR latch. There is heavy interaction between the two sides of the latch and the cubes are given to you in pairs. The test is designed to be solvable in a number of different ways. Please let me know if please let me know of all the different solutions you have come up with. I hit an entity limit, so I apologize in advance if some of the puzzle elements seem a bit simplistic. The entity limit also required me to move some lights, so I apologize if in advance if parts of the test chamber seem too dark. Made some optimizations updates to the test to reduce possibility, the probability of not needing to use any of the funnels. One funnel is there just to ensure that the test remains solvable, though I don't really think you need to use it. Save often, don't touch active laser fields. I discovered a trapping situation, but can no longer update the puzzle. All right. Let's, um... All right, so... Pick a side, it seems. Oh, there's two things there for the exit. Two things on both sides for the exit. Alright, so two lasers for the exit. Gotcha. Alright, so this is non permanent. No point in taking that back, though. That would just be silly. As for taking whatever we find in here out, then I guess. All right, let's have a look. See what we got. Upper area, which we're going to come down at some point. Okay. Have some gel. Rule number one, knock. Don't touch the laser fields. Feel. All right. So, we're back over here again. Fail. Man, I lose so much momentum. What? That's better. Jeez. Oh. So I can't get this until I've done something on the other side. Hmm. Alright. So... Let's go up here. Oh, I just came from there. Duh. Okay. thing I need to do. A 
I don't know, but it's a thing I've done. How does that help me? How does that help me? I don't know. If I was to fizzle the cube... Thing. I made the cube go somewhere else, so... Alright, I'm gonna go to the other side, because... I don't know if I'm missing something, but I just don't seem to be able to... I did say I needed to like interact with both sides quite heavily. Laser. Oh, this is the okay. This is the bit where I was before. So, with that laser, I want the cube. And then I can do that. Okay. So, guessing I might want to leave that on the laser for the time being. It's just a hunch. And this is where I was before. Gotcha. if that's what I wanted to do. But I certainly did it. What does that actually do anyway? That's doing... Oh, it's opened that panel. Okay, that's exactly what I want then. Okay. So now, probably forget about the laser for now. It seems to be like almost everything done in this area. Hopefully. was it? Bet your bottom dollar. It's the one. We have to go and fetch the other cube back for. As well. Oh joy. you really need two fizzlers there though could you not have just done that with one potentially all right save
Right. I'm not going to put them in place just yet because I might need to use them in a little bit for something else. I don't know. So if I'm thinking about this right, there should be a cube waiting for me in here. Which there is. And then the other one should be waiting for me over here. And that should be it. Okay, so... Um, the size of it is just simply a lot bigger. Than I was... Um Hold on, I'll concentrate better in a minute. So yeah, I kind of thought it would be it was going to be worse than it actually was because gauging by like the size of the chambers, um, they were quite vast, and it gives the impression that it's it's quite in depth. But I'm thinking back to your description, you did say in the description that um, it's not the most complex of puzzles. Um, there was only really one bit that I had to backtrack, but if you did everything in the right order, you wouldn't really have to do that. If you went in this chamber first, rather than the one on the right, you could do everything in one go without having to go back. Um, yeah, other, other than being like pretty simple, um, wasn't bad. I mean, there were some elements I didn't use. For instance, the I used the faith plate for that cube rather than the funnel, so I don't know what the funnel was for. But, um, yeah, there we go, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any match lines to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link to that in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock. You've been awesome. See ya.